Peen, have you seen Archie? I can't find him anywhere. Archie? Archie, where are you? Archie? Archie? Where are you? Archie? Where are you? Archie? Archie? Oh, there you are, hello! You're doing the washing! Beep! <laughs> the Brit Vlog. Nine cat approved. Morning, morning! <clears throat> Little Archie there in the kitchen. We didn't go to Nan's yesterday because they were going out later and they didn't want anyone visiting or something. I don't know. It was a crap excuse, so whatever. Um, as I said, we're going to go to the steam rally later as long as the uh, old weather holds up. Pete's making me a quiche because I'm starving. Hi. So, yeah, so I've got to go and take care of Archie where she makes quiche now. So, um, we shall take you along later. <coughs> do, do, do. Do, 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 do. I like the tunes on that on that toy thing. It's good, isn't it, Peen? Yeah. Peen's made. What have you made, Peen? Quiche. You've made some quiche. What is it, Peen? A cheddar and pancetta quiche. Yes. Looks very yummy. You are starving, apparently. I am starving. I haven't had any breakfast. I've only mentioned this about 555 times. What was that? Well, <laughs> I need to mention it a bit more. Anyway, numbs time. <laughs> Speak up in the wind, Peen. I'm speaking up in the wind, and we're going to go and see what steam things are here. It's a little, little tiny one. It's very cute. There's a big one behind. Oh yeah. They're trying to get them to give kids rides on, but no one seems to be rushing to do that. So it's very over there. But it's cold there in the back. And it's a simper. simper. <laughs> it's an engine on a diet. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's fine, you're fine. Nice. So cute. That was a little tiny steam drain. I'll zoom in. It's very cute. Tiny train. I'm going back again now. Oh, it only goes that far. Well, it was a little thing. I was on the way over here, Pete. Okay, now then, uh, the Ducky Program Battle. I'll give you 10 minutes. Hey. This one's motoring. Speeding. You're going to get a speeding ticket in a minute. Nice. <laughs> oh, sorry, that's a bit of the sky there. Oh, typical peen camera. Your name? Your name? Nice pretty uh, steam engine so coming over the sky. James and Joseph, we've got a pair of twins. Ah, oh, James, that's a lovely name. Yeah. Right, James, we've got a pair of twins. It's not compulsory to talk on the mic. I know there are lots of children are shy. These are speeding now. Making kiddies on ride. But he does it all the same. Speeding along. Look, I'll just show you this really big train track. Like me then. Hello, you two. Are you happy? Here. What's your name? Stop. Edward. Then ask the back And go back there. Very close. Yeah. Pull a broken down. That engine over there is apparently pulling that engine with magical steam power. With steam power and a rope. And a rope. It's very exciting, team. That's what they used to do in the olden days. I thought they were just like toys, but apparently no, not. Bean thinks they were toys. Well, I didn't realise they are, like, they got tax and everything. They, like, can go on the road. Yeah, they're working vehicles, Bean. Back in the day, these is all the farms had for power. They replaced their oxen and horses with, Both with makes sense. cool little steam engines. Although, wouldn't it have been expensive to buy? Um, well, it's all relative. Like, if it costs you, you know, £2,000 a year to keep a horse or two, and it only costs you £4,000 to keep a steam engine that lasts you uh, 20 years, far more cost effective, isn't it? I wouldn't say you'd get the job done quickly. Well, no, but it's a lot quicker than if you were using a horse. If you wanted to turn, tow like a ton of steam engine, you'd probably need like four horses or something. Here's another thing coming past steam. 
Yeah. Watch Archie's feet when it comes fast. It's very yep. exciting. It's very exciting. Can round to it in a sec. Wait, 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 wait. There's the train. There it is. Look, look, he's excited. Look, look at him. Oh, he's positively cheering. Fantastic. <laughs> Little man. <laughs> This one has got a passenger. This is Aidan's favourite. I've got no This one is called Jack. Plenty of room. No, he doesn't. No. He doesn't have you can like sit in through the hole in the top though. Bye Oliver! Um you can see the teeny tiny steering wheel. That's amazing. Now this is going to be very interesting to see how many volunteers for the road one today. It's a tiny one again. I've been in the afternoon and not usually used to this. And uh this one over here as a dog passenger. And uh, may not be able to make the, the dog is getting quite excited. So instead of 30 or 31 engines that we had yesterday, they're going out on the main road. Down. They've got to line up in the arena. Okay, they're all waiting to go on their road run. Lots and lots of engines. And a pram. Off we go. Going, going. Don't forget the rules of the uh, go ground today. You must tiny one. follow Chris and uh, do not overtake him. <laughs> oh, Baggy stopped again. I think Baggy's going to cause some issues on the road. Around. He is. There's another tiny one. Oh, good shoulders. <laughs> oh, here's my favourite one. Baggy's stuck again. Come on, Baggy. They're looking to overtake Baggy. They're, overta they're breaking the overtake rules already. I'm not quite sure that's a steam engine. Hmm? I'm not quite sure that's a steam engine there. Uh... What? Oh, that. <laughs> I don't know. Baggy's off. He's off. We can't see him being obstructed by uh, Eve. Oh, there he is. Hey! Tiny little one! Oh, here's Oliver. Or Black Pearl, as it's actually known. Ah, it's like 23 degrees. It's so hot. Idea. Well, there really was no other option. I cannot wait to open this. Mmm. So cold. Mmm. <laughs> Cheers everyone. Can't beat it in some of Well that was a jolly day, wasn't it Peen? Mm -hmm. Have a jolly day. It's good. Exciting, go out to see the rally thing, that was fun. It was nice. It's been very, very hot and very sticky. Might have a shower before bed, it's horrible. So um, yeah, good weather, nice weekend. Hope you all had a nice jolly weekend and jolly weather as well. We shall see you next time.